scary kid. <laughs> like way more it, scary. I agree with that. I just I like to I like to ex through booms. It makes me feel like a big boy. Yeah, it makes me feel good. Oh my god, he's spinning. Haha, spin your meter. Haha, spin your meter on full screen. What are you gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm just gonna throw a sonic boom. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> got him. All right. Uh, this is a reminder. By the way, I'm drinking Strawberry Sky by Breckenridge. Oh, Shit's Breckenridge. delicious. I like the vanilla porter. Oh, I haven't had that, but I've heard people talk about that. The vanilla, if you can ever find vanilla, their vanilla porter on tap, my God, one of the best beers I've ever had. Uh, I don't think, I don't think we can get that here, but Dude, I, I had I've a been tap a... in Florida. You can Damn. find it somewhere. Well, like, so my in-laws live in Fruita, Colorado, which is like four and a half hours south of me, and I guarantee you they'll have it there. They've got good stuff on tap in the Colorados. All right. I wasn't paying attention to the matchup, so we got uh, Jazdera with the Buki going up against... Pump Pop Pump? Okay. Yeah, big Pop Pump. I'm trying to decide what to do because on the one hand, Luca and Kill Stamps haven't started playing yet. On the other hand, 1025 was literally the first message in Discord that Kill Stamps sent. So I hate both of them right now. Well, good luck with that. Okay, yes, Daryl going with the Colleen pick against this uh, Balrog. I actually think that's not a bad idea. Um. I struggle with the ball up matchup as a Nabuki player, so I could see Jezdero wanting to go with Colleen here too. So Jezdero overall is just trying to switch to Colleen, and his going is oh. getting a lot better, but it's uh, and it still needs a little bit of work. So we'll see how sure. it goes. Yeah, well, this is the the trial by fire, the experience in tournaments and yep. you know higher stake situations. Yep, and this is the place to do it, right? Oh, nice whiff punish. Side switch. Go for the oh, they in front. Yeah. That good defense from uh, a boy Papa Pump out of New Mexico. Okay, damage coming. Yeah, put you to the corner as well. This is gonna be big. Trying to bait out a throw here doesn't come. Just gonna toss him up himself. Yes, they're looking super good. The back throw. Oh no. Oh, gets him with the big overhead, and now this is gonna be damage. Oh, he missed the last hit. Yeah, wasn't gonna come anywhere, but the <laughs> EX carry on your Let's knees, boy. Go! You love to see it. I love to see it. I have no one to blame but my Round two. Well, that roundhouse getting a big crush. All right, but going into it, your pomp's trying to play a little bit better game with these dash punch, spacing them a little bit better. Now you can see Yans there is like really just pushing these fierces, trying to find the crush, trying to use V skill just to catch something, right? Yep. Yeah, I like this jump range just from Yans right? Trying to stop. Oh, using that V skill to get through the dash punch. Activate, stop the target combo. Good tech. Yeah, Pomp just backing up to a spacing where he feels comfortable, where he knows that he can challenge after the target combo on the slide in. Big crush here, back to the corner we're gonna go, pretty much tying up the life leads again. Every time we see as at the corner, tying up the life lead, but cross under for Pomp. What's he gonna do? Gets him with the oh, dome again! You gotta watch it! That's the second time we've seen Jazdero get hit with that. Yeah, just it almost feels like he's watching it and just like choosing to stay crouching sometimes. But just overall, his mind is just so busy looking at all yeah. the other options that Pomp can do. Maybe expecting to throw on these resets instead. Well, like you said, this is a, uh, like uh, Kamikaze said, this is a character switch, right? So it might be a newer character for Jazdero. Doesn't have some of the muscle memory locks, so his mental stack isn't always paying attention in certain situations. Corner to the corner. Yep, yeah. good corner control, putting on that pressure, but a bad challenge oh, on gonna get stunned. Get oh, no! Back the same way, but mess up An elaborate oh, reset! Oh, oh. Yeah, Let's he, he go. Saved it. I think he messed up his stun combo, but he found the way to save it. He's like, okay, I got this. I can turn it into this. Gonna activate here. Got the shimmy with the throw, and that's gonna be game one. Yeah, dude, I love that choose your own reset, right? Like, he was flipping through the book and was like, shit, I went to the wrong part of the story. Uh, page 37. This will work. Oh, yeah, like, I, oh, I can, I can, I can spin the. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I can spin <laughs> the X bar, and it'll uh, hit this meeting. It'll be fine on the cross. Yeah, yeah it's, it's fine. It's fine. It'll, yeah. it'll, it'll, it'll yeah. hurt. Yeah. 
Yeah. It's all together. <laughs> yeah. That was super sick. Round one. All right, but changing up the knock here. <laughs> Putting the pants down. Again the dome, but the trade this time on the delayed jab. And nice whip on the ground. Yeah. Oh, okay, no. bad one this time. Just buffering it, just expecting Pomp to, to push something into it. <gasps> Challenge there? Wow, great. Yo, he reversed Shimmy Team. He walked out of the throne, punk. Right. <laughs> Too far away from full target now, though. Unfortunate. Yeah, in a pretty early activation for Yas Zero here. I'm wondering if we're gonna see him try to spin more of it early or, or just kinda hold on to it and sit on these big normals, but Oh Ooh, that Yeah, not yeah, really weird. That looked like I, I don't know what that was, because it looked like he was trying to do something meaty with the hands, but Oh Good and job. we saw before that he was able to uh, to get that parry out and sneak in mm -hmm. the, the, the W, but this time Pop going for the throw. Yeah, seen it once, not gonna fall for it again. Anti airs. Oh, okay! Messed up the throw timing a little bit. Oh, wow, swing with that big fierce. And another town, not a break. Yeah, I knew that's one of the things that you never let Boxer do to you. You'd never be too, too afraid of him, but another just miss Boxer there for Yaz there. It's causing him a lot of life here. Going to the other corner of the reset! reset. Again, not protecting the dome. Oh, the oh, shimmy! I'm the shimmy with the back dash. My man, Pomp came to play today. That shimmy looks so sick because of Balrog's back dash animation. Like, Balrog. it just looks so dope, right? Like the pull back and the go in. Good it, shit. It, yeah, the, like like the slide back like makes him look so mm -hmm. smooth, especially mm -hmm. with the shades. Main's wrong. Shades and that shirt, that outfit. Mm. He's at the club pulling off the dance moves. Yo, that's. I, I want to know. I want to know if Annie's okay. Oh, by the way, Kamikaze, update the uh, the, the rounds. It should be uh, first to three. Oh, yeah, this is top eight, isn't it? Yup. Yeah, big pop of pump looking like a smooth criminal in that game. Let's see what comes up next. Yeah, I mean, going back to character select for Yastera here, it really makes you think if he's going to try to pull out that Ibuki, uh, which I think really defeats the purpose of, of the Colleen. Uh, to be honest, I feel like if you're trying to practice the Colleen up in this situation, you go back to character select, you think about it a little bit, you think about the match and what you can do. You slow down. Realize you ain't no bitch if you get back into the Colleen, right? Yep. Yeah, you, like like you, you slow down uh, Pompadour's roll and you head right back into the Colleen, but we'll see what he yep. decides to go with here. Yep, going to that Ibuki. Wow, even rocking the pink, the dragon, or the Monster Hunter costume. Yes, Daryl, man, a person of my own heart. Yeah, he definitely yeah. really likes this this costume. He does he does switch between a couple of them. Wow, trying to challenge that roundhouse to fish for a crush counter. Yeah, get some fishing for the crush counters. Gets a confirmed two off the four heavy kick and finds another one. Didn't go for the two nine setup. He says just the medium to so keep wow. pressure. Okay, that stuns. Oh no! Oh, too far. Yeah, yeah it was too far. Yeah, then the kunai charge also costs him some life here. Let's see what Pop can do with the second chance at line. Yeah, this is gonna be tough. I like that back away by Yazdaro. Gets out, gets a reload, interrupts the forward movement. Side switch. Nice no, check. No, drops, drops the, the combo. combo. Was a little bit too fast on the target combo there. And <laughs> you saw that they both tried to do the throw. Pom had the correct situation in mind, but with throw plus five on block. Right. Well, I like that back dash. Get your V skill out of here. Look at that, Q and I. There you go. awareness out of Jazz there. Yeah, keeping the V skill at bay. Using the right of this Kunai to get the dash. Wow, that long sweep catching. Okay. That should have been a challenge from Big Papa Pump, but not ready for it. Activation. V reversal doesn't want to hold the plus. Gets crush countered. Drops. Good chance punish. Yeah, Darrow's gonna. Oh! Tried to fake the kunai release and got anti aired for it. One touch will do it to Super, though. Looking for that confirmed. Yo, spins a bar just to get the two gloves on the face cheeks. Let's see what's gonna happen here. Yeah, Darrow just needs one confirmed, only a little bit more chip as well. It's getting close to it. Oh, he got oh, his he was doing it. He was going for the chip scenario, yeah, and just let it rock. 
yeah, especially with the, the Grey Life that was stacked up, it definitely had the chance of doing enough chip. I'm not quite sure, but, yeah, I mean, you know, you'll, you'll never know. Yeah, they are going to go up 2-1 to one here. Yeah. That's right. We're not high fight. We're not going to recreate the whole round just to see whether or not a better combo would work or the chip would actually happen. Yeah. Well, I would have loved to see more of Jazz Derek's Colleen. This Ibuki pick definitely working well. Oh, yeah. Uh, Yazaro is Ibuki. It's just so good. Yeah. Wow, well, with punish with that knee? <laughs> oh. Yeah, almost oh, like I gotta write some stuff down. Knee. It's that it's that classic knee that you see in footsies, right? Just the uh, yep. it's just a knee. There's no other way to say it. It's just a knee. Yep, just a good knee. Time you got to whip punish somebody. Yeah. Oh, he gets the activation as well. It was a counter hit, but almost looked like a whip punish. Stayed in front on the reset, but goes behind on the secondary. Yeah, he was playing. I didn't realize he was playing B skill too. Let's go, yes, yeah, Dan. Side was it? Oh, the throw, but yo, oh, okay. Really tried popping over there to recognize the cow drop animation and just bust through with the EX low. Gets him up one time. Yes, Darrow was patient. Didn't get gripped up the second time. Didn't get caught trying to move away. I like the V reversal. Oh, not able to Except. use anything off of it. Instead, just gets a little tippy tap to the shins and goes mm -hmm. down. Yeah, I did not realize Yes, Darrow was playing that V skill too. I'm really happy with this. I like yeah. how it's interesting that he spends the uh, the kunai to get that damage extension on these EX juggles. Yeah, it also pushes a little bit further, right? Yeah. Just both players kind of poking back and forth. Good challenge there. Yeah, nice punish, actually. Sorry, punish. Yeah, you're right. For some reason, I yeah. thought that was a V skill. Uh, even V skills might. Have been oh, really? Oh, the That's trade was too far away for Pomp to get the combo, but Yaz with the whip punish. Didn't, didn't drop side the switch. Time. Yeah, got the side swap. Getting big damage here. Not enough. He's one more. That was combo. Uh, yeah. Just needs a touch, though. If you guys can just hang back, play it light, play it easy. Gets caught in the toes. Ooh, and man, grab, grab, man grab, and that'll be it. We're two yeah, apiece. Up two to two. We going into the final game, ladies and gentlemen. This has been such a back and forth set. Every time it seems like Yaz Dero has made the adaptation to win the entire set, and like yep. he's just going to steamroll the next game. Pomp has really consciously made some good decisions and has been able to run it all the way back against Yaz Dero. Yeah, something I'd want to see Yaz Dero do because we've seen it come up twice now, right? Where Yaz Dero is pretty close to full screen away, has the life lead. Just throw a couch drop down and rebuild your your Kuna, right? Because Balrog can't rush punch in on him. He's going to get hit on the couch drop on the ground. So it kind of helps you control the floor a little bit and just watch for the jumps. I wonder if there's a reason Yazir is not doing that. Yeah, and Pomp is just able to find these spacings where Yaz is just a little bit uncomfortable. Like standing outside of these, like the same medium punch range, the sweep range, and finding opportunities to, you know, whip punish with the dash punch, go right in there, but get side swapped here on the command dash. Interesting mix up choice there. Using the using the DP at that range. Now challenge from Big Papa Pump. Damage coming. Gonna get that V skill charge up. This is a big hill to climb for Yazdaro, and that hill is Balrog. Ooh! Yeah, and he, again, just a perfect spacing from Pomp. They're out of range of the low forward activation from Yazdaro, and then just slid literally right back in there, gripped up, got the damage that he needed to close out that round. All right, not going for any of the Kunai mix there, just opting to, to go for the safe cross cuts. Nice punish there from Pomp on the sweep. Oh wow, now we got these whiff punish rush punches coming in where uh, at the range that Yazdera was trying to fish for crush counters. Oh my oh. goodness! Commodore has figured something out about this neutral game because he's just getting hit after Minus hit. four. Yeah, it wasn't enough for the stun, but he tried to follow up afterwards. I was pretty sure he could have blocked if he wanted to. Got side swapped. Do it again. Mix here again. Stays in, in front. front. Side switch to go behind. Land the low. Oh, oh overhead to... gets punched oh, that was out of there. That was... You know that was a view reversal gone wrong. You know it. You know it. Oh. It's beautiful though. I mean, all I know is that Pomp is moving forward into into grand final. Not grand finals. Winter finals. Grand Excuse finals. me. Yeah. I want to see more of this Ibuki from Yazdero though. That was good stuff. Oh yeah, he's uh, 
He's regular. So you can you can always if you wanna check the VOD, you can always check the VOD, but he's he's here almost every week. You can see more of him. Alright. And I'm sure he'll do well on the loser side of the bracket in addition. So we need Matoha versus Blarleg. It looks like PL Stamps is trying to DQ himself out of this round. Yeah, he played he played against Blarleg. Yeah, it sounds like there's some controller issues going on. Matoha is listening. Blarleg sent in the invite, so we'll get underway shortly. Oh. Yeah, there he is. I'm just trying to fix this bracket. Dance. Also out. Rest in 